Welcome to this CalRTA mini tutorial on how to respond to the CalRTA legislative alerts that appear periodically in your email inbox. As you can see, I have two legislative alerts from CalRTA in my email inbox. Let's take a look at what we're being asked to do. I'm going to open this first one simply by clicking on it. Now this first alert is requesting that we email a list of representatives who have not yet co-sponsored a bill, in this case, HR 82. Now the first paragraph of the email explains the action needed and the rationale, while this second paragraph down here provides some easy instructions. You'll then find a list of contacts, including the names, and states of representatives we want to contact, a phone number if you wish to make a call, and the name and email of a staff member who will receive the email message. You'll then see two gold buttons down farther in the email. One allows you to forward this email to a friend, while the second one provides information about the bill and a list of co-sponsors. Even farther down, is a suggested message if you choose to call the representative's office. Now this provides a brief script for you to follow. So let's send our first email. Now I've scrolled up to the top of the contacts here and the first step I need to make is to click on the email link right here. So I'm gonna click here. And as you can see, a pre-populated or a pre-written email pops up to the right. Now this email here is editable, so you can actually add whatever information that you want. Well, I'm going to add a salutation by placing my cursor right here at the beginning of the email, and then I'm going to uh, address Representative Mark Vesey. So I'm going to type in, Dear Representative Vesey. I'm going to Whoops, okay, type this in. Enter twice. Now, I don't feel like I need to make any changes to the content of this email. I like it the way it is, although you, you can add details wherever you like. All you have to do is place your cursor where you want to add material. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and press the Enter key two more times. So I'm now down here and I'm ready to type my closing. So I'm going to simply type sincerely. And I can go down two spaces and simply type my name. Or if you have prepared a signature, and as you can see down here, I have my, um, my email menu. And this little pen right here allows me to insert a signature that I have created. So I want to adjust this a little bit by bumping my name up, and I think I'm ready to go. So I take a look, make sure that I've got everything spelled correctly. It looks the way I want it to look, and now I'm going to simply click this Send button. Once I do that, I return to the page with the emails, and I simply go down and repeat the process with the rest of the contacts. And that's all there is to it. Responding to these legislative alerts is an effective and easy way to participate in CalRTA's advocacy efforts on behalf of current and retired educators. Thank you for doing your part.